Well, welcome back, everyone. So my next guest has been on with me now four times. I have with me Monty Flack, and he's with True Wealth Legacy. Um, I know that Dr. Uh, uh, Dr. Dykeman is also on the line now, and he's going to be uh, calling in, and we're going to have him chat a little bit, too. Uh, why don't you just tell everybody a little bit about what it is you do? Listen up. I've been reading about this, and a lot of every time you talk, there's somebody in here that totally gets it, that goes, As I know we, we need to do it. Tell them what you do. Well, first of all, thank you for having us again. Uh, Dr. Dykeman is with clients today, so he should be calling in. What we do is we help people create their finance system using a dividend paying whole life insurance to complete this process. For one thing, we are putting our money to work. So our money is making us more money. We can still use it because the way we design a life insurance policy. And uh, on top of that, I'm protecting my family. So, okay, we're going to open up the lines to the audience because everyone is going to get uh, entered into win this book. It's called Becoming Your Own Banker. It's Unlock the Infinite Banking Con- Concept by best-selling author R. Nelson Nash. Now, it's a book that when you're reading it, it's very interesting, and you get it at first. You're like, oh, yeah. But then there's times where you kind of say, hmm, I'm not sure I quite understand it. That is where you guys come in. Well, we help them along the whole process. Right. Uh, you know, like this past weekend, we were up in Snowflake doing a presentation. And, of course, you know, we sold some books and so forth. But we break down what infinite banking is. Right. And it's all about understanding money and the players in the game of money, savers, borrowers, the bank owners, and the bank itself. And the way we are taught, to, the, the way we are taught to use our money is deposit in the bank, then we borrow the bank's money to go make our purchases and uh, pay back the bank principal and interest, and therefore transferring our wealth that we go out and earn to the bank. Bank makes a profit. Shareholders get that. So what we do is teach them the infinite banking system and why the infinite banking system, why a whole life insurance policy. This is what the big boys use. This is what conventional banks use. This is what the rich use. And so all we're doing is emulating what they did. Well, they keep on getting richer, those rich. Now, we have Dr. Dykeman, and he is on the line calling in. Doctor, welcome to the show. It's amazing what you do. Uh, you do not purchase anything unless it goes through your, what do you call it? Policy. The, the policy. Okay. I mean, I'm, I'm learning a lot now and tell everybody a little bit about yourself too, real quickly and what you want to tell them today. Okay. And, uh, hi, Carol. And, uh, thanks for uh, having us on again and hello to all your listeners. Uh, yes. So I'm an orthodontist and I'm at the office right now, but I wanted to take a moment out so that I could support Monty in, uh, in explaining some of the circumstances and realities about what we teach to your listeners. So first I wanted to remind everyone one more time, whenever you go out to buy anything, you always finance the purchase. In other words, you use other people's money and pay them interest, or you use your own money and you lose the ability of your own money to earn interest for you for generations. And the wealthy people have learned that if you continue to do that, then you make the bankers rich and you make the bankers uh, survive, but you don't help your family. So the infinite banking concept is to establish a money pool for an individual family, and we do that by using a specifically designed dividend-paying whole life insurance policy where we develop and build cash value, not from our work, but from the work of the insurance company, and we then turn to the, our family then turns to the money pool that is in the life insurance policy, and we use that as collateral to borrow from the life insurance company against the collateral of the life insurance policy. We use the borrowed money from the insurance company for our purchases of either product or service, and then we pay back to the insurance company, thereby replenishing the money pool and the interest that we pay on the loan and the additional interest that we pay because we're using our money in effect is that that helps to grow the policy more without an additional contribution of purchase. 
So, in other words, the interest that we normally would be paying to third-party lenders, we now have turned over into the insurance and our particular process, so our policy continues to become bigger and bigger and bigger, and that growth ultimately is the entire source of money pool that we can turn to for all of our purchasing, financing, and whatever. And Ultimately, I've gotten to the point where I can now essentially borrow the money that I need for all of my personal life and all of my business life from the the collateral of the policies, and then I pay it back from my earned income in such a way that I can then turn around and borrow the money out again as I need it. So it's constantly flowing between me and the insurance company rather than between me and other people. And the money keeps on growing. The money keeps growing every time that we pay it back. Every time that we put some money back in with the insurance company, it immediately starts to grow in what is technically a tax-deferred basis. But in reality, with proper design and proper utilization, it will be a tax-free basis. And that that tax-free accumulation is dramatic. And um, with proper design, we can also teach individuals how they can utilize that uh, as a retirement fund. And so I'm going to let uh, Monty take over now because you remember that when Monty uh, talked last time, he talked about how in the in the corner bank, in the, the brick-and-mortar bank, there's a bank owner and there's a banker, and then there's a saver and there's a borrower. But in reality, Monty and I and everybody that we teach is both the bank owner, they're the banker, They're the saver, and they're the borrower, so they're the entire game of the movement of money. And what Monty's going to explain today is how to use that movement of money to purchase a car, and uh, and he'll walk the, the listeners through that. Carol, thanks again for giving us this opportunity. Thank you, Doctor. Okay, so we've got our lines open here, and everyone's going to get entered in to win the book, Bank Becoming Your Own Banker. It's Unlock the Infinite Banking Concept by R. Nelson Nash. And our line's open here, 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. And uh, you can call in and get this book. And I'm going to let everyone... Uh, you know, call throughout the rest of the show for it. It's absolutely fascinating. I love listening to it. And every single time you come in here, whether it's usually people in banking and some sort of financial area, whether it's real estate, taxes, or IRAs, or whatever it is, they all t- say the same thing. Yes, I agree with you. This is the way we do it. Some people are already doing it. That's correct. Go ahead. It's interesting that the gentleman that's on next is... Later on. Or later on. Is practices this also, so it's it's not new, it's just new to the masses. And uh, like Dr. Dykeman said, I was going to talk to you about how do we transfer our wealth. Well, Carol, have uh, you purchased any vehicles in your life? Yes. Okay. And out of any of those vehicles that you have purchased, do you have any money back from a single one? No. Okay. So what you did. Well, either you saved money, pulled it, wouldn't pay cash for it. That money can no longer make you any more money. Or you borrow money from a bank, typically, paid them back uh, principal and interest, therefore transferred your wealth to someone else. Well, if we were going to create our own banking system using the dividend paying whole life insurance policy, we would start paying ourselves first, creating a money pool like Dr. Dykeman says. We would borrow from that pool of money, collateralizing our cash value. Now, all that means is, let's say I I have $25,000 worth of cash value within my policy. The bank says, or the life insurance policy says, okay, you have $25,000. I will lend you $25,000 from the pool of money. Therefore, my money never leaves that policy, and therefore it compounds. So each year it's going to get bigger and bigger. So I don't interrupt the growth of that money. Whereas when you pay cash, you build up that money, pull it, you interrupt the growth. That money can no longer make you any more money. So it's an uninterrupted compounding. And that's what we want. This is what the rich use. This is what the banks use. Now you have a a webinar that's coming up tomorrow. Yes. Go ahead and tell them about it real quickly because we're going to go to a break. Well, like Dr. Dykeman and myself, uh, 
we work with a few other agents. And tomorrow we are producing our very first uh, webinar. And, um, yeah, we would like to have as many people on to spread the word. And we're going to talk about how you can do this. And we're going to show some practical examples of, like, uh, one of the other agents, how he used this policy after he learned this. He funded a policy, borrowed from his the insurance company, paid off his vehicle, paid himself back. He paid off his wife's vehicle and his vehicle. And uh, on his wife's vehicle, made 44%. And on his, he made 26%. So he made money on it as well. Exactly. To himself. So the book is called uh, Becoming Your Own Banker. It's Unlock the Infinite Banking Concept by R. Nelson Nash. You call in here and get it, and I'm going to let everyone get entered in to win. Our number here is 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. I Welcome back, in. everyone. And we're talking with Monty Flack, and uh, we've been talking about this um, becoming your own banker. Coming, it's more than coming and becoming control of your money. It's way more than that. I mean, you go ahead. It, it is. It's uh, not having to rely on others. Because have you ever needed money? The worst time to apply for a loan All is when you the need time. money. <laughs> yeah, so the best time to apply for anything like that is prior to that. Well, you got to fill out the application, and it's got to be approved or whatever. And the, in the meantime, you're wondering what the heck you're going to do. Well, by creating my own money pool, now obviously my pool's not quite to the size of Doctor Dykeman's. Uh, he's been doing it a few more years, and, and but so you've forth. been doing it a long time. I've been doing it. Uh, I started practicing infinite banking uh, nine years ago. When, okay, so it's or, not a short yeah, amount of time. Go ahead. Right, um, but. Now, when I need money, I just make a phone call. It's that easy. And they don't ask me what I need it for. It's no denial. They don't check your credit? No, no, not a single thing. Right. And all I do is write my name on a piece of paper, send it in, and in a few days I have my money. Now, um, but we were talking about this at the break. Why people, you know, don't understand it? It's not the norm. It's not taught. And... um in my studies, I have found that this was common practice prior to 1913. And there's a couple of uh, specific events that happened in 1913 that most people are aware of. Uh, you know, the gentleman before me was talking about taxes. Well, when did uh, the IRS come into play? 1913. When did the Federal Reserve come into play? 1913. So this was taught prior to that. And if you still look at it, the wealthy practice it. They still teach it to their kids. The banks use it. So it's... It. You were saying that the Bushes, this before we got on the air? Yeah. Uh, I don't want to get into all that, but if, if you do your research and talk about or find out what happened uh, just prior to 1913, who all met uh, to, you know, it's start the, the central... Banking system, the Federal Reserve. So it's not a new concept. It's just something that you have to think. But you know what? That's where they come in. They're here to educate. That's what you're all about. You've got your new webinar that's coming up tomorrow. And we want everyone to call in. Uh, We're going to give you the book. The book is uh, Becoming Your Own Banker. It's the Unlocking the Infinite Banking System uh, Concept. And it's something that, you know, I've been reading about it, too. Uh, And how much? Okay, wait. Before I do that, let me go ahead and, and give out the phone number here. Here. Okay. So everybody can call in here and I'm going to let you call throughout the rest of the show and get this book. Just read it. It's not, it's not, it's a, it's, it's an interesting read. It's, it's something that's going to open up your eyes. And at, at some point, that's when that would, well, that's when, uh, Mondi will come in and he will help you understand it. And from the get go, it'll be like a step by step, somebody holding your hand in order to do it and do it right. Right. And that's a, a very important point. When we did our presentation up north this past weekend, one of the gentlemen there has had a policy, actually has a couple policies, and um, policies were designed correctly, but his issue was he was never really taught how to implement them and utilize them. So while we were there, he had quite a few aha moments, you know, grasping the idea and how to move the money, and uh, because of that, he would like to continue to work with us from here on out just because of that uh, 
the education that so, we provide. So the number to call here is 602-277-5369 and toll free it's 1-866-536-1100. Get the book. I'm going to let you call throughout the rest of the show for it and, and learn and learn something that maybe you might want to do. I mean, in most people you say when you start talking to most of these people, um, they all have, must have a ton of questions. Well, <laughs> yes and no. Typically, the majority of people you talk to, they believe in their 401k, their qualified plans and, and what they've been doing. Because you're, this is a paradigm shift. Do th- okay. Okay. A pa- I don't know what a paradigm. I was just going to say, do people think it's a pyramid? And you said it's a paradigm. And I was what? Yeah. But is it's not. It, this is not even close. I mean, if people go online and Google BOLI, B-O-L-I, it's an acronym for Bank Owned Life Insurance, and just see the plethora of sites talking about this. Um, Robert Kiyosaki's huge. He's a proponent of, of, of infinite, infinite banking. banking. Uh, our senator, John McCain, he, most people don't know this, but he utilized the, the cash values in his life insurance policy to fund his campaign. Walt Disney used the cash values in his life insurance policy to get Disneyland started. So there's examples of this all over the place. And a couple of weeks ago, it came out that ex-Vice uh, President uh, Joe Biden had almost $20 million in cash value within his system, his life insurance system. Well, the number call here, we're getting our calls. I know we are. Our number here is 602-277-5369. And toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. Get this book. Get it and start reading it and find out. This is just another way of making actually more money than, you know, right? Correct. It's a better way. Correct. (laughs) It really is. Because I don't, how many people leave their money in the bank anyway anymore? Hardly anyone. Some people have, most people have it under their bed. (laughs) It's true. Well, if you, yeah, we could talk for another hour on just that. But uh, it's just get educated. That's the whole thing. Get educated. You know, talk to us. We will sit down. We could do. I know people here in the valley with traffic and so forth don't want to get in the car and, and drive be stuck in traffic for 45 minutes to get to a presentation. To Same make thing. money on your money? Why not? It's amazing. <laughs> it I, is amazing. That's what we have found but, out. But the, uh, but you have the webinar. We have the webinar. And then the thing is also that we can do a, a consultation over a webinar also. So they can sit at home, uh, you know, be there with their kids, have dinner and everything. And then, you know, so we can schedule those things on their own time. So it really quickly, just say again what it is uh, so that people understand anybody that might be just turning on now. Go ahead. Well, it's a system to keep your own money, to take control of your money, to put it to work so it's your money's making you more money while you still utilize it to go out and make the purchases and just your everyday costs. And get all that money back. Does it cost a lot of money to start? I think that's another thing. Maybe people think that you have to have a lot of money to put down when you're talking about life insurance and this and that. No, no. And that would be a one on one conversation. My very first policy was a $5,000 policy, $400 a month. When I learned about this, I quit contributing to my 403B because I was a teacher and redirected it into a life insurance policy. So. And why did I do that? Because I learned, I understood quickly. No, you, why did you do it? You said you had a need for it immediately. Well, because you weren't making enough money as a teacher. Not even close. Well, look at what they're fighting for today. Mm-hmm. My very first teaching contract was less than twenty three thousand hmm. dollars. Can't live off of that. Right. But once you started doing this, not only were you able to live, you didn't have to get a second job. No. Right. No. And so you are now doing what you're doing, and. You're purchasing everything. You're even going into real estate, I understand. Well, I went into real estate actually prior to oh, okay. learning this. Oh. But I did use my policies in real estate, which was really nice also. Yes. See, he's smiling big time here, you know, because well, you make some nice money on it. Well, I get giggy, giggly uh, whenever my, what well, most people call it the premiums. I call it a deposit when that's due because I'm just making more money by making that deposit, because within a short time, I'll be pulling that money back out 
to move it. What would be your final words? We have two minutes, and I want to let you get out anything you want to say. If you have any debt, you want to recapture your overhead in a business just uh, just to get started, just give us a call. Call into the show. Call me directly. Either or. You know what? If they're all about educating everybody on this. They've been doing it now for quite a long time, but it's been around for ages, and it's something that the rich do. So the book is called Becoming Your Own Banker. It's Unlock the Infinite Banking Concept. It's our by best-selling author R. Nelson Nash. Call in here, and I'm going to let everyone call throughout the rest of the show for it, and get the book so that you can start reading and start learning, and they will help you and Hold your hands through the whole entire um, uh, process. Again, that number here, 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. Tomorrow night, you're having your webinar. Yes. You can call me, and I can get you connected with him in order to do that. You can call him direct as well, which is 928 928- Two four one zero six six eight. But I say call in here, get the book, and then what we'll do is we'll get you connected with him. So get on this webinar. It's going to be awesome. It's a free webinar, and you're going to learn all sorts of information on it. Yes, and this is just the first one of many. But- so call in here, our number here, 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100. If the banks are doing it, if the rich are doing it, and he's doing it and doing it very well successfully. Dr. Dykeman has been doing it for many, many years, runs his entire practice on it. There must be something right about it. Give us a call here, 602-277-5369. Toll free, it's 1-866-536-1100.